In problem number 21 of section 4.3, we're asked to find the orthogonal trajectories of the family of hyperbolas x squared minus y squared equals k, where k is some constant. Now, remember that the an ortho, or a orthogonal trajectory um, to a, a given curve is a family of curves such that when any uh, curve from the second family intersects a curve from the second or from the first family, which in this case is a family of hyperbolas. Whenever they intersect, they intersect um, at a right angle perpendicularly. Uh, so what we want to do first is find out well what's the um, slope of the tangent line or the slope of the line tangent to any point on the hyperbola. So we can uh, differentiate uh, with respect to x. Uh, so we have 2x minus 2y times y prime. And the derivative of um, constant is just 0. Now we uh, rearrange the equation and solve for y prime. So we have y prime is equal to negative 2x over negative 2y which we have the negative signs cancel out and the 2's cancel out. And we see that the slope, um, slope of the line tangent to any point on the hyperbola, tangent to the point x, y is equal to x over y. Now we want to find the uh, family of, of curves such that the slope, um, of the slope of the line tangent at any point is the negative reciprocal of this. So we want to find, uh, just to clarify, we'll write capital Y uh, for the uh, second family of curves. We want uh, the derivative of the um, second family of Y with respect to X to equal negative Y over X. And we can rewrite this dy dx is equal to negative y over x. And we can now separate variables and write dy over y, or negative dy over y. Actually, we'll keep the negative side on the right-hand side. And on the right-hand side, we'll have negative dx over x. Now we can integrate both sides, on the left with respect to y, and on the right with respect to x. And on the left we get uh, the natural value, or the natural log of y is equal to minus the natural log of the absolute value of x, and plus some constant. Now, if we take the exponential of both sides, we get natural, or excuse me, the absolute value of y is equal to uh, e the minus natural log of x plus c, well, technically plus e to the c. And uh, this will be just equal to uh, 1 over absolute value of x. Oh, actually, excuse me, this should be e to the negative natural uh, log of the absolute value of x plus c, which we can then write as e to the c times 1 over uh, the absolute value of x. Now, if we'd like to be able to get rid of the absolute value signs, and we see that if, um, if we do that right here, we'll end up with uh, plus or minus y. And on the right-hand side, we'll have e to the c, 1 over plus or minus x. So we can write this um, a little bit more precise way, just by a little bit more clearly, by saying y is equal to, um, call this constant a, times 1 over x, where 
a is equal to plus or minus um, e to the c. So we see that uh, the family of hyperbolas y equals a uh, over x, where a is this constant defined here, is, um, are the orthogonal trajectories of the original family of hyperbolas that we started with.